crowds really seem low here at Universal Orlando. Laura might have been right the last time we were here. Like it is dead. I'm always right. Until maybe we get in. Welcome back to your Daily Dose. We're headed inside to go into the new Minion Land, which is technically not open right now. I believe it's soft opened still. I would have been here opening day, but we are all the way in Punta Cana, which was amazing. Have you been inside yet to see it? No, last time I was here was with you in the gift shop. There we have it. Let's go check out what Minion Land has to offer. We're both really hungry. We're gonna try some food. We're so hungry. Last time Laura was dressed like a Minion. On an accident today, I purposely did not dress She like did not. Minion. She did not, but we do have some Halloween Horror Nights announcements as well. The Last of Us is coming to Halloween Horror Nights. Stranger Things are rumored to be coming. Boy oh boy, these next couple months are gonna be great. And Laura, we're just talking about an adventure. We don't know if we're gonna do it yet, but I know she's doing it, just depends. I'm doing it. It depends if I want Kyle to come or not. Yeah, <laughs> I'm <just> right? kidding. <laughs> no, she did say that. She did say that. Minion Land, straight ahead. So all you gotta do is go straight. Do you have an update on the left side of the entrance? Look, they're, they're building the roof. I've got it built out. Still only here is a way to enter. Real quick, comment down below how excited you guys are about Minion Land. Like, I'm kind of like a six, six out of 10. I, I, I like Despicable Me, but I don't really feel like I have a strong attachment to Minion. Like, I'm obviously excited because it's a new part of a theme park, but you know, it's not like that. I'm like, oh my God, Minions, I can't wait. Maybe for the ride, can't wait for the ride. How do you feel? I'm two out of 10, I'm not a Minion person. <laughs> you were last time you were I here. You were last time. I could care less about the minions. Hey, by the way, you know that fart gun? Yeah. It farts banana scents. No way. Yeah. That's kind of funny. All right, actually. welcome to Minion Land, everybody. Maybe I'm a seven. Maybe I'm a seven. Wow. Oh my God. Minion blast. Please open. It's supposed to be soon. Oh, they're going in the secret. Oh. Ooh. Look, 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 look. Ooh, ooh. We got some workers going in. Should we run in? Ooh, ooh. <laughs> ooh. There's your sneak peek, everybody. Last time we were here, we just checked out the Evil Stuff Shop, which is right here at the end of the new ride. Straight ahead is what is all new. Colors are really pop. Holy camoli sauce. Bake my day. Illumination, looks like that's like meet and greets. It looks like it. Yeah. There's a bake my day, but it looks like the stars of Singer coming. Hold on. Perfect timing. Laura, can you? Ooh, I love this song. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who are these characters? They're from Sing. I've never seen it. Laura, dance for us. Yeah, yeah. Let's go eat. I'm still standing. All right. So you can get uh, pictures, videos. You can meet them. But that's uh, toots your horn. But here's a look at kind of this section. So meet and greet. This looks to be sort of kind of just an outside of the building, nothing really, just aesthetic. Cake bake, do you want to go inside cake bake, bake my day? I mean, I love some cake. She loves the cake. Let's check it out. Bake my day, I believe this is kind of like another shop, but it also does have some food offerings, obviously, because, you know, bake my day. When I first thought of it, I thought it was gonna be like more of a bakery, which I think it is, but there's actually just Lots of merch. Let's go check it out. It's right across from the exit of the new ride or the evil stuff shop. Hmm. Oh, it's really tiny. Pink as well. Casey would love this. Nothing like the smell of a new shop though. Let's go around so you guys kind of have a general look at the shop. Smaller than I thought it was going to be. It is tiny. What are the ads you wear this for the rest of the video? Do you want it? No, I want you to wear it. No, I want you to wear it. <laughs> Come on, Laura. No. It doesn't really go with my aesthetic. Here's a look at the, the shop. Super tiny. How does this guy feel? Oh, it's like rubber. Never mind, just kidding. Definitely a really cute shop at that. It kind of reminds me of like a shop on a cruise ship. You know, like the, the ice cream shops. That's kind of the vibe that I'm getting. It's very cute, very cute. Look at this. 
Laura, do you, do you check up right there? What happened? I don't know. I don't know. How did you get stuck? <laughs> I think that's that's gum or something. Did you help them out? And someone was shooting arrows. At them. <laughs> How mean? How would, why would they do that to a menu? Yesterday at Disney, I just had so many sweets. Here's kind of a look at what they have. They got Swiss rolls, cookies, s'mores, cupcakes, cake pops, minion apples. Do you want to get something here afterwards? I don't care. What we do. do you want to start with dessert? Well, we can buy it and then eat it with the food and then review it. Okay. Okay. Right? Okay. Should we get a six pack of macaroon? Um, Is yeah. Flavors? Yeah, yeah. But I actually want to get all the like, cool stuff in the bottom too. Like, look at the s'mores. Quick look at all of the prices. I think we're going to go for the six piece of the macaroons and then we're going to get a lovely uh, s'mores. They've got a lot of cute merchandise aside from all of the food offerings cupcake bites, gummy cupcakes. You said besides from the food offerings, and then, and then you anyway, all the food. Well, this is candy. That's, that's sweets. Is that, is that the same class or no? I, it's the same class. It's fluffy. It's so fluffy. I feel like a little kid in the candy shop here. It's definitely for kids, but it's cute. Oh, I found out who shot the arrows. Right here. I think you need it. You yeah? Want it? You want it? What would I ever wear? To Universal. <laughs> This is something you would wear. This is totally you. How it's got like that. This is totally you. That is totally me. 60 bucks. It really is. <laughs> I think we're ready to order. Uh, Nick or Doodle? Bag secured? We got the goods. All right. Out of bake my day we go, and on to the next. That's gonna be desserts. Laura, I have a confession. Being here now, my seven I think has gone up to a nine. It's just so fun. My two has gone up to a 2.5. <laughs> maybe we gotta get her to see the movies. Or maybe these macaroons will change my mind. Maybe. So we were just in bake my day. We have freeze ray pops, just we're gonna check out here in a second after we get some food because Laura said they look good. Let's actually take a look at some of the offerings. Should we do that after we eat? Yeah, we probably should. This will be our after dessert. Look at them. See, this looks great now, but... Oh my gosh! You gotta get the Can you guys see that? We've got a mobile order window and I believe this is actually for the main restaurant quick service which is right down here. So that's actually nice that they have a mobile order pickup. But I want to head on inside because it's all brand new. The colors really do pop. It sort of kind of reminds me of Avengers Campus, like right by Web Slingers. Just like it looks spray painting. It looks really, really nice. They did a good job. Lots of good photo op opportunities here and just really pops. Bank of Evil. This looks to be opening a little bit later or this is nothing. I don't think that's anything actually. It doesn't look like that is a access area for for guests. But here's where we're going. I think Laura was just calling me the Minion Cafe. Different sections inside. There's actually a huge line right now, which makes sense. Brand spanking new. I see Laura already sitting in line, so thank you, Laura, for that. Here's a look at the outdoor area. Yellow on top. Oh my goodness, look at this. These are like order sheets of uh, minions sending orders to uh, the kitchen. Well, I just got an exciting phone call. Something has just arrived at my door, which is amazing. Can't wait to show you guys that, but here's kind of a general look at the area. Colors again pop. Fun colors, minion colors, obviously. Let's check to see what Minion Cafe smells. It smells really good. Like, does it smell like grilled food? I don't smell anything. That's not good. <laughs> no, I don't smell anything. <laughs> we got an LCD screen here that actually rotates on what the menus are gonna be like. So it's not like a static screen. See, look at that. It's pretty neat. There's so much to be seen here. We also have a new popcorn stand that we're gonna check out 
after as well. Now this line in the beginning is actually for mobile order table. So you have to wait in this to actually go sit at a table. But if you guys just want to mobile order and do that pickup window, you can. But I suggest actually just coming here waiting in line. Then you can see the place. Or just watch this video and you'll see the place. By the way, the minions are still actively working. So uh, see how they haven't finished painting the, the wall? Maybe you should, you, this is why you should have dressed up in yellow, Laura. You could have helped them paint. You could have helped them paint. paint. It looks like uh, the Minion Cafe opens at 10.30 and this line has been moving pretty fast. We're probably not going to be able to select which room that we go to. We'll find out. It took all of like five minutes to get to the front. Fast turnover. A couple of you guys are in here right now. That They watch the videos. They were just taking pictures of me and smiling. So a shout out to you guys. <laughs> we can create that. <laughs> all right, let's head on in. Wait, Kevin's taking us in. Awesome. Kevin. Hey. Yes. <laughs> all right. Oh, it's way more wide open than I thought it was going to be. You're Kevin. I'm Kevin. You're we Kevin. Kevin the big boss. He's oh, in there. Kevin's right there. Yes, okay. Yes. Yes. Well, hey, uh, let's get you a table. Where would y'all like to sit? We've got. I think this is nice. Oh, yeah. look at the, look at the. That's cool. I didn't even that know is. that. So much natural light. This is fine yes. if we can get like a corner or something. Yeah. Hey guys. Hey hey hey. Hi hi hi. All right. We'll check out everything here in a second. I just gotta wipe it down for yeah, you. Yeah, fine. I'll go right there. I'll go by the refrigerator because it's probably a little bit cold there. there. Oh. oh there okay. This is really fun. It is. All right. Wow. Do you think the minion's gonna escape? The I don't know. Do you guys see him? He's in there. He's literally in there. And we got some desserts here too. Hey there, y'all. Fellow, welcome to Illuminations Minion Cafe. Kevin, he actually watches the vlog, so that was that was perfect. Perfect. All hey, right. thanks for visiting, Kyle. Of course. <laughs> Excited. Do you guys hear that? Yeah. He's pounding, Laura. Laura, pounding? he's pounding in the freezer. <laughs> I don't know if you guys heard that, but um, they have little QR codes on the table for us to scan, and that's going to be in the menu, and that's going to know exactly where they deliver all the food, so that's really cool. They do have... A cash wrap if you guys don't want to do mobile. I haven't found it. I haven't even explored. We'll do that in a second here. I think we're just going to kind of pick our selections and, and order. This is so funny. Like, look how creepy that looks. Laura, I think I'm at a 10 now. 10? Okay, I might have moved up to a 5. <laughs> All right, let's go look at the food here. All right, so here's a quick look at the menu. That QR code uh, is going to bring up the mobile orders and just all the restaurants here at Universal. And then you obviously click on it, Minions Cafe, and it's gonna bring up the menu here. So here's the menu of what we are working with. Definitely not gonna order all of it, just because of the fact that that's a little bit too much. We're gonna order some fun things though, and what I think will be good. There's something really cool that I think I want. There's the antidote for a drink. I don't know what that is, but I wanna try it. So upon a checkout, it's gonna ask you to enter your table number and they shall come. Food is ordered, but I wanna show you guys our room that we're in because it's pretty darn cool. It looks like there's one, two, three separate areas, which is just kinda of like, I believe, Monster's Cafe. Wait, um, this is the PX41 Punch. Is there ice cream on there? I, I don't think it's ice cream, I think it's frosting. That's frosting? I don't know, let's see. Looks like Pop Rocks too. Whipped cream. Whipped cream? Oh actually, my goodness. It's actually really good, it's like um, a lemonade. Mm, can I try it? Strawberry and kiwi. This came really quick, the drink did. This came literally uber fast, it was like on Uber Eats. <laughs> really good. That is really good, sugary though. Yeah. yeah, today's all about sugar again guys. Try this. Oh god, not me. <laughs> is it Pop Rocks? We're in trouble guys. This place is really, really fun. I've got Pop Rocks currently going on in my mouth right now because of Laura's drink. Here's the kitchen where all the food comes on out. We have bananas on the walls. This place is bonkers. It's very open feeling, smells new, we love that. This is a, a whole separate other room which we'll definitely have to go check on out here in a second. Here's actually where you can order too. They're really not stressing these. Mobile order seems to be what they want everybody to uh, theoretically do. Sunlight, tons of sunlight. But the center is really where the main fun is. Oh, they've got booths over here too. Didn't even 
didn't even see that upon entry. See what I mean? It's a huge room. Got bananas up there too, you see that? And the pipes. The dishes. This natural light is making like the video very hard to focus. Here's our center display, there's Kevin. We got a boot. Looks like a minion gave up his boot. Banana. Bananas. Looks like Laura's shake that she just got. Unfortunately this doesn't move though, it's static. There's a pan on the walls up there. They've got pots and pans, minion style. You guys see that up there? And we're right here. <laughs> Laura has a friend. <laughs> you enjoying your time? What's so funny? My mouth is probably perfect. Yeah, let me see it, let me see it. Off from the main section, this is the booth area. We're gonna kind of keep rolling here because I want to see what's beyond over here. Tons of seating. Again, they walk you to where we're gonna sit. How deep does it go? Oh, wow. Holy cow, this is a fun room. Like, look at that. Nice. Now here's the banana factory. Looks like this is where they bring all our dishes and it just gets sucked on up. Playing a Despicable Me movie music as well. It's playing Happy. I love that song. All right. See, look at the colorful walls. Superb. It's a very cute feeling. And now this is gonna enter into the main area. We're going on over here, and we're back to the center. A big fun feeling. I really like the art too. It's a very fun vibe for sure. Let's see if the food's good. That's the important factor. Oh, we have one more room. One more room, which is gonna be right off here to the right. Here we go. Follow me real quick. Oh, okay, this is more of like a cafe feeling. Very close off. There's foosball here? That's cool. You can eat on a foosball table. Yeah, this is more like a, I don't know, kind of feels like 50s vibe. Oh, look at this. You want some water. Oh, is this backstage? It is. Just see here in a second to my left. That's how they punch in and punch out. <laughs> That's funny. Then we head on into the back here, more foosball tables. Okay, this one's fun. I actually wish I was in here. That is cool. Their lockers as well. Where's Kevin's locker? Someone's sleeping in there? Oh, there's a minion sleeping in his locker. All right. How neat. Oh, who's in play of the month? <laughs> All right. How fun, how fun. Oh, wait a second, a vending machine? I keep going from one thing to the next. Be like, all right, we're done, we're done. No, we're not done. We get shoes, bananas, obviously. A fart gun, <laughs> some hair. All right, Universal, good job. This was really fun. Food time. All right, drinks come first. I got the anti tail and Laura's tongue is so purple. I don't even know what this is. Let's give it a sip. It's supposed to taste like bananas. Confirmed. Bananas. Does whipped cream taste like bananas? Whipped cream tastes like whipped cream. That is so good. Mine's too sugary. Don't count your calories when you eat it. The cups you can keep too, which are really cute, really cute, and the drinks yeah. are good. I think Laura's is better, by far. Lemonade, you can't go wrong with that. If you want it, it's really sugary. What? I don't even like lemonade. I don't know why I ordered it. I just think I liked it because of the color. My goodness, my um. As many drink just, come alive. It just had a reaction. Went <laughs> the antidote. <laughs> <laughs> So Kevin just told us that if you stir the whipped cream into the banana drink, it'll turn into like a banana cream pie drink. 
Yeah, very creamy. Almost too creamy. Laura's has arrived. If you didn't know, Laura's a piggy eater. She got the kids grilled cheese, which comes with a little banana and um, some really cool tots. But her cupcake is also really cool as well. Banana! <laughs> banana! <laughs> I'm so excited. It's so cute. It's pretty good. I'm gonna go raid for its head. It's actually really good. It needs ketchup. We don't really know where you get ketchup. Maybe just ask Kevin. I think that's what we do. Pimento grilled cheese time. Oh, it's pimento? Yeah. I love pimento. I mean, how is it? There's no, oh, it looks a face of disappointment. It's fine. <laughs> like, it's not like amazing, but it's not bad. You know, just a kid's grilled cheese. Can't really expect anything crazy. Wait, that's my grilled cheese. Honestly, this is really good. I love pimento cheese, which is maybe why I love it. That's really good. Pimento is actually kind of like some of my favorite cheese. I don't know why. I love that. It's better than okay. I just don't think I like pimento cheese. They also give you waters too. So Laura's food came a little before mine. She uh, ordered before and she is just taking right on into the dessert. Even though we had dessert from the other place. We didn't eat it. But we didn't eat it, but she just just wants to eat her cupcake. I wanted to eat these desserts, but Kyle wouldn't let me yet. So now I gotta eat my own dessert, because Kyle has no say in my dessert. <laughs> it's so fluffy. How do I eat this? That's bubblegum frosting. Oh, it's funfetti. Oh, that's gonna be good. Remember, Laura's a very picky eater. Very picky eater. We need another bite. It's very dry. Look at the eyeball, wait, look at the... <laughs> I personally love fun confetti. That's dry. Not the best cupcake. Yeah, that really wasn't that great. Oh, that's cute. Food has arrived. Oh, I got an actual like fake banana, that's cool. An actual fake banana. <laughs> the tots. Oh my god, look at the pizza. Let's go. The pizza. What else did we get? All right. Oh yeah, the steak and cheese. Look at this. All right, thank you. So yeah, um, this pizza looks phenomenal. I actually want to try the pizza first, but before I do that, I want another tot because these tots are great. Oh. Guys, there's something about this that is absolutely amazing. I have my own cheese gun. Never seen that before. That is cool. We asked for ketchup and they gave us a whole thing. That's cool. But look at look at how they actually like splattered pizza all over the plate. Super cool. We're gonna let Laura cut this open and I'm gonna film it. Because we're both gonna try it. Ooh. They <laughs> got the cheese pulled. Alright, have a bite. Now this is good. Even though I think I just ate cheese, but it was good. <laughs> the sauce is good. I'm gonna go right for a mozzarella ball. Just because I'm weird like that. That's a good mozzarella ball. It's not bad for quick service pizza. And it's really fun. Give it a seven though. Actually, give it a 6.5. Still really good, but pizza has to be really, really, really good for a seven, eight, or nine, or a 10. So we have the steak and cheese ray right now. Here's what I mean by my cheese gun. Look at this. I can literally squirt cheese into my very own sandwich. That's so cool. <laughs> Incredible. That was pimento cheese. The blast was pimento cheese. I love pimento cheese. All right, here we go. I think everybody from Wisconsin should probably order this since it's got cheese in its name and it comes with a cheese blaster. Pretty cool. Look at that. Look at all that cheese. It literally just looks like cheese on bread. This is good. This is everything my, my stomach dreams for. That's my winner so far. Alright, let's cut into this banana here. Oh, it's hard. Did you see that? Wow. Let's give it a scoop. That is amazing. That is better than a regular banana. Wow. That is a must try. Must try just for the banana. Now let me try this. The cake itself. I wish that they just had the banana on the side. Cause I feel like the banana overpowers that. Banana is so good. Just get it for the banana. 
and it's a cool photo op. By the way, that banana wasn't banana flavor, it was passion fruit. I love passion fruit. Fun vibes in there, some really unique offerings. Now let's move on to this new stand, the popcorn. We're just eating a lot, my goodness. Here's a look at the popcorn stand. I don't know what options they have quite yet. We're gonna find out here at Papanana. Got really gloomy out here today. It smells great. Here's what they got. Oh, they have the antidote. They you can also get that specialty drink out here too. Same with the, the punch that Laura got. Are you gonna try any? I don't know, I'm not a big banana person. I think this is gonna be weird. It's got a hint of banana. That's interesting. You can tell which ones have a lot because it kind of looks like kettle corn. <laughs> I'm not a banana person. It's not like an overly crazy amount of popcorn. It's just enough. It's worth a try to see if you like it. When are you ever going to have banana popcorn? It's like a hint. Yeah, it is like a soft coating, like a kettle corn coating, but it's banana. It's not bad. <laughs> this is who we wanted to see. Look at this, right as we were leaving. And you can get pictures just right on over there. After seeing the minions in person, I changed my answer to a 10 out of 10. I'm a big minion fan. Last but not least, we've got these to try. We gotta try the macarons and food review with Mighty Macarons. The macarons. Cute display for sure. That's Blueberry lemon blueberry. lemonade. Look, they're really cute. Ugh. Mm -mm. What? Mm -mm. Uh -uh. Uh, no. This is either cotton candy or bubble gum. <laughs> that was not good. Uh uh. That's bubble gum. Let me try it. Much better. Birthday cake? Question mark. Where's my cookies and cream? Mmm. That's good. Cookies and cream. I'm really excited for cookies and cream. <laughs> it's good. It's not bad. Cotton candy is good. That tastes exactly like cotton candy. Oh, this is great. Snickerdoodle. I will say that. Wow, that one is really snickerdoodle. Yeah. I will say, the ones in Disneyland, the at the Jolly Holiday. Oh my gosh, still the best macaroon I've ever had. I actually am not impressed with these. I think it's just because my first bite. They're was, not that great. Honestly. They're really not the best. I I say pass on that. But we do have one more thing. We have the s'mores, which. It's surprisingly not melted right now. Is it banana or just regular? It's regular, regular s'more. Well, you're enjoying that. Thanks for watching, everybody. Ooh, banana. Good. Hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope I enjoyed it. Look at this banana. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a good banana. A good banana. Honestly, the s'more is pretty good. Yeah, s'mores was good. See you guys tomorrow. <laughs> Minion Land, now open.